today we're going to be breaking down how you guys can create these fire gunshot finger gun effects these are used in a bunch of drill and rap music videos so i thought i'd go ahead and show you guys how you can do it with a little bit of extra sauce added as well i'm going to be uploading tutorials on this channel every single day for the month of may so if you aren't subscribed already go ahead and do that let's hop right into this we have this clip open from the nle chopper music video for dope now we're going to go ahead and get started on the effect here we're going to be using this muzzle flash that i have if you guys do want to go download it it'll be for free in the description below we're going to go ahead and unlink the audio from it and if we play it through you guys can see it has a black background now to fix that we're going to go up to effect control go to blending mode and we're going to change that to screen here once we have it on screen as you can see it's going to fit exactly with the footage now we're going to crop it to where it starts right here and we're going to go through and listen to certain points we want to put it at all right now that we have them aligned to where we want in the video footage <laughs> We have that as the end product. Now I'm gonna go ahead here and resize them using the motion to put them on his hand. So we'll put that one there and we'll resize this one up and put this one right here. Then this one as well, put it right there. It's looking great so far. Now to add a little bit of extra sauce to it, we're gonna go ahead and create an adjustment layer here by right clicking and creating one right through here. Now we're gonna hit okay and drag and drop that in our composition. My adjustment layers are preset to eight frames, but for this case scenario, we're gonna change it down to four. So so one, two, three, four, and then cut it. We'll have two of them here and we'll hold alt and drag to make one more. When the gunshots hit just like that, we're gonna put them lined up there. Then we're gonna go ahead and use my fast movement effects V2 pack here. And with these, if we open up the best ones in here and these are cool, we'll have a bunch of hits, a bunch of different transition. We can throw on a couple hits just like that. To tie everything together, we're going to go ahead and do some sound design. Now, the gunshot effects that I'm going to be using for this, you guys can grab in the description below for free alongside the muzzle flash. All right, so we have our pistol sound effect in here. I'm just going to go ahead and trim it to fit. We're going to go to exactly the first frame where this hits and put it like that and line it up where the sound effect goes. Then exact same thing by holding alt and dragging. Same thing here. And then for this one here, the exact same thing. And now I can already just tell from the audio waves, it's going to be way too loud. So if we play it through, it'll show you. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and turn them down here to about minus 10. Ignore that weird glitch there. I don't know why my Premiere does that. If you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial and want to download the sound effect and the gunshot effect, they'll be in the description below for absolutely free. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe as I'm gonna be uploading every single day for the month of May. Let's go crazy. Let's run this channel up, guys. Peace.